What are you doing here? Go back to your live streams. Stay calm. We're sending officers now. Ah, great. Jesus! How's it going, everybody? My name is Morais, and welcome to Night Reception. Boy, if there's any job I would hate is working at night, a reception of whatever this place is. And why the hell does that man just keep looking at the desk? Do you need anything, sir? I haven't started playing. I'll be with you in a second. It was just another regular shift for me. You know, checking guests in, finding their rooms, and making sure they were settled. Nothing out of the ordinary, except I wasn't in the best mood that night. I had a fight with my girlfriend before heading. She was upset, saying I work too much, never have time for us. Yeah, seems like my life. Honestly, it felt like just another argument. I figured once the night ended, I had smooth things over. As usual, the guests arrived, and I did my job. Greet them, pull up their reservation, and guide them to their rooms. Simple, right? But that night, there was something different in the air. Maybe it was just me. But, greet them, pull up their reservation, and guide them to their rooms. Maybe it was just me. But, I couldn't shake the feeling that something wasn't quite right. And it turns out, I wasn't wrong. <laughs> Wow. Such drama. Let's, uh... Let's see, race manager. Customer name. Um... Okay. Notepad. Nothing in a notepad. Let me write some motivational quotes. Ah, customer. Hi. Good evening. The name's Victor. I've booked a room for the night. Victor. Of course, Mr. Victor. Follow me. I'll show you to the ER room. Thanks. Been traveling all day. I hope the room's comfortable. Yeah, it sure is. Um... Okay. Victor. Room number six. Alrighty then. Let's go. Follow me, sir. Ah, here's the motel. Wow. It looks exactly like that game called Motel I played. Crazy. Jesus, I don't like how you follow me, sir. Okay, room number six. Just down here, sir. Um, so as you can see, this is a pretty, pretty comfortable room, I would say. I mean, pretty normal. You have the bathroom over here where you could take a shit. You have the bed over here where you can have sex all night. You have the TV where you can put porn. You have the couch where you can cry your fears and your exhaustion levels of depression away. Well, are we here, Mr. Victor? Oh, wait. Here we are, Mr. Victor. If you need anything or have any complaints, feel free to call from the front desk. Thanks. I'll let you know if I need anything. Appreciate it. No problem, sir. Have a... Alright. Have a wonderful night. It's over here. Oh, a fuse box. That for some reason is already open. Well... Time. Ah! I was gonna write more motivational quotes, goddammit. Let me write one real quick. Um. Yes. Okay. Um. Hi, lady. Hi, I have a reservation under Evelyn. Certainly, Evelyn. I'll take you to your room. Follow me, please. Thanks. It's a bit late, isn't it? This place feels so quiet. Well, it's a fucking reception. What do you want? And why does your face always make me feel feel like I need to treat you badly? Evelyn. Evelyn. Um... I'm sorry, did you say your name was Evelyn? E uh... 
Evelyn? Evelyn? Itch? Okay, so I'm just gonna give you a room. There you go. Let's go. Room number one. Follow me, bit. Here we are. I hope you, uh, you enjoy the room. It's, uh, here's the bathroom where you can cry yourself to sleep. Here's the couch where you can just cry yourself to sleep. Here's your bed where you can, uh... As I was saying, there's your bed. Or you can cry yourself to sleep. Okay, there was something over here I saw. Huh. Hell yeah. Oh. Damn, I suck. Pro player throws it from here. Oh my god. I got it! First try, baby. <laughs> Can't you see I'm playing? Here, catch. You fucking suck. Hey, name's Scarlet. I have a reservation, right? Yes, Scarlet. Let me show you to your room. Great. Lead the way. This place is kind of creepy, don't you think? Well, it was fine until you showed up. Did we have an update on the system or... Or what? Like, is there something I don't know? Like... Fuck it, I'll just take you to room 10. I don't I don't know where your room is, but let's go. You don't have to you don't have to sneak up on me like that, Scarlet. You're very uh very very uh very close. Very mwah. I did not make out with that woman. She made out with me and now I'm going to take her to her room. It's the only thing right to do, right? I mean, it, <laughs> here we are. So, this is the bathroom. Where? This is the bathroom. S uh, Scarlet. Don't back me up into the wall, Scarlet, like that. I mean, this is your room. Stay. Scarlet. That was your room. Was it not, Scarlet? Scarlet. This. Alright, Scarlet, get on bed. So apparently I gave this bitch the wrong room. Let me get another key. Let's go to the next room then. Okay, I hope this is the right room. I'm sorry I'm new at this. Um, It's not going to be the right room, is it? Okay. If this isn't your fucking room. Ah. This is your room, Scarlet. If you have any requests or concerns, feel free to call the front desk. Got it. Let's hope I don't need to. Thanks. God, I hope I never see you again. I better water the plants until the new customs arrive. Ah, fine. Any more plants? Well, well, new customers arrive. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. It's on now. What? Wait. wait. Excuse me? Oh, a little kid. Wait, that's not a little kid. Hey, what are you doing here? It's the middle of the night. Aren't you a little too old to be playing on a swing? Old? Who's counting the years anymore? Time stops here, in this place. What do you mean? Shouldn't you be in your room or home? Home? I've been waiting here, watching. You've noticed it too, haven't you? Notice what? You're not making any sense. You'll see, soon enough. We all do, eventually. What are you talking about? What will I see? They always come when the lights go out. Who? Also, weren't you the one supposed to tell me that? Hey, I didn't even see this guy come in. And, well, it's a woman, actually, but damn, that neck. 
that physique. Very muscular. Hi, I'm Lydia. Can you take me to my room, please? Of course, Lydia. I'll take you there right now. Follow me. Thank you. I just need to settle. Be s to get settled quickly. All right. Uh, Lydia. Why this, is there no rooms found? I mean... All right. I'll just take you to one of the rooms that are already open. Follow me, please. You will be settled in room 10. Or 11, actually. Yeah, you can stay here. Here's your room. Okay, if this is not your fucking room, then here's your room. There we go. Oh, we have this bed where you can uh, cry yourself to sleep while thinking about the bad choices you've made in your entire life and why nobody loves you and why uh, everybody will hate you for the rest of their lives. Here's your room, Lydia. If you need anything or have any problems, just call us. Thank you. I... I will. Okay. Let's actually work, shall we? Evening. The name's Damien. I think I have a room reserved reserved near room 11 yes Damien follow me I'll show you to your room perfect let's hope for a peaceful night yeah 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 very very peaceful first we need to make out real quick and then you go to your room um I don't want to alarm you but your room is uh, open but I can assure you nobody's inside I can assure you that it is uninhabited. Okay? So. Here's the bed. Here's the bed. Get in. This is your room, Damien. Feel free to call the front desk if you need anything. Oh, I will. If necessary. Thanks. Huh? Is it coming from the fucking desk? Damn. That's loud going good evening this is the hotel kitchen it's time for dinner service how many meals should we prepare for our guests tonight good evening we'll need five meals got it five meals we'll have them ready and send them to the lobby in about 15 minutes perfect thanks you're welcome if there's anything else feel free to give us a call perfect Holy crap. What the fuck? Hey, here are the meals you ordered. Five in total. Thanks, you seem in a hurry. Yeah, the faster I finish, the quicker I can end my shift and get out of here. This place gives me the creeps at night. I get it. Same here. Anyway, thanks again. No problem. Take care. Dude, you give me the creeps at night. What the fuck are you doing here, Ronald? Mc... Donald? Oh, I need to give them personally each one? God damn. Oh my fucking god! Oh, you scared me. A little bit, you bit. Whoa. Sorry, I just about to knock. I was just about to knock. I guess I was a little too eager for my dinner. No harm done. Here's your meal. Thanks, and sorry about that. You really caught me off guard. It's alright. If you need anything else, just let me know. So I scared that bitch? The fuck? Here's your meal, Lydia. Oh, thank you so much. This place is so quiet, it's eerie. Yeah, it's definitely peaceful. If you need anything, feel free to call. Thanks, I will. Have a good night. Ah. <sighs> Um, here's your dinner, Damien. But I don't even have anything. I appreciate it. Took you long enough. Sorry for the wait. Anything else you need? Not for now, but I'll let you know. But I didn't even give him anything. Well, Damien's gonna have some imaginary food. Well, too bad for him. I guess I'll have his food. Well, this motherfucker fell asleep. Good evening, Victor. Here's your dinner. And I know you're old and 
you hear pretty badly, but do fucking open the door, you piece of shit. Ah, finally, I'm starving, thanks. No problem, if you need anything else, just give us a call. Will do, enjoy the rest of your dinner. I mean, your night. Dinner delivery, Scarlet. I know uh, it might not be of your liking, but here you will go. Thank you. I was just about to ask when it would arrive. Here you go. Let us know if you need anything. Your thing. Enjoy your evening. And I do mean anything, Scarlet. Do let me know. If you want some hardcore sex. FBI, open up! Damn, I don't know what's going on with me in this video, honestly. Been harassing my clients all night. Alright, I've delivered all the meals. Great, how did it go? Any issues? Not really, but one of the guests said they thought someone knocked on their door earlier. It wasn't me. Hmm, could have been another guest. These places play can play tricks on your mind at night. Yeah, maybe. Anyway, thanks for the quick service. I'll be glad when my shift's over. I hear ya. I've got one more round of deliveries and I'm out of here too. Hang in there. Will do. Have a good night. You too. Stay safe out here. Before you go, can I have that? One guy did not take it. Wait. 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 Don't go. Ronald. My meal. What is it with these games where you're in some sort of a reception, kiosk or whatever, Light just goes out. Okay. Jesus. Mr. Davis, what are you doing here? I expected to see you. It actually scared me for a second. Mate, you are literally queso. What the fuck are you doing here? Oh, sorry about that. I didn't mean to. I'm staying in room three tonight. Just checking in on things after the power went out. Oh, you sure you weren't the one who took the power out? Right. I forgot you were staying here. Everything's fine now. I just had to reset the breakers. Good, good. I was worried something more serious happened. The power can be tricky sometimes. Yeah, it's all sorted now. Well, since you're here, the reception desk looks a bit messy, don't you think? Could you tidy up before the guests start noticing? Sure, I'll take care of it right now. Thanks. I'll head back to my room then. Let me know if anything else goes wrong. What are you doing here? Go back to your live streams. I swear to God, this wasn't as messy as it is right now. Okay, you have room. Going. Hello, is this a reception? I'm Scarlet in room 12. Listen, something strange just happened. While the, power, while the power was out, someone tried to open my door. I thought it was you, but I it didn't see anyone when I checked. That's unsettling. I'm really sorry about that. I'll come right away and take a look. Okay, thank you, but please hurry. I feel really uneasy. Right. Oh. Excuse me, what the fuck is going on? Hello? Who is this? Is this some kind of joke? If you're messing with me, stop now. Can barely hear anything. Say something, who are you? If you don't stop, I'm calling the police. This isn't funny anymore. Scarlet, open the door. It's some is something wrong? I can't hear you. Alright, going to force it open. Oh shit. This how could this be here? Maybe it'll come in handy. But I don't I hope I don't I hope I don't have to use it. Okay. What the fuck? This has gone too far. I can't handle this anymore. I need to go to the reception and call the police right away. But why can't I help her now? 
Okay. Let's just go to the reception, I guess. Okay. Let's call emergency services. What's going on? Someone's in one of the rooms. A woman is screaming for help. I think she's in danger. Where are you right now? I'm at the reception of motel. Someone broke into her room. She's calling for help. Stay calm. We're sending officers now. Ah, great. Jesus! Damien, you son of a bitch! It's finally over. I managed to survive, but Scarlet is still missing. The police will handle the rest now. I don't know what really happened tonight, but I know I'll never forget it. This place will always remind me of fear. The fear, the danger, and how close I came to losing everything. Now, I just want to leave this nightmare behind. A game by Ace. Ace. Oh, so that guy is Queso. God damn. <laughs> when you're just that big, huh? I meant big as in famous, guys. Come on. God damn it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. The game was pretty funny and it was overall scary and creepy as well. And I enjoy this kind of games. I've played Kiosk and the other Night Donor game. They're on screen right now and they're very similar to this game I just played. And I hope to see you on one of them. They're two of my funniest videos, for real. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. See ya.